Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on how to manage a case of thyroid storm. For definition, thyroid storm is a life-threatening condition, characterized by severe clinical manifestation of thyrotoxicosis. Investigation to do is the thyroid function test, where the expected result is low TSH, high T3 and T4 levels. Assessment of the patient is done using the birch wartowski score. More than 45 is suggestive of thyroid storm. For treatment, first we give beta blocker. This is to control the symptom and signs induced by increased adrenergic tone. Propranolol can be given as it can inhibit conversion of T4 to T3. Tablet propranolol 60 to 80 mg 3 times per day or 4 hourly. Or, IV propranolol 0.5 mg to 1 mg over 10 minutes followed by 1 to 2 mg over 10 minutes every few hours. Second, give thioamides like propylthiouracil or carbimazole. Third is iodine. Administer SSKI or Lugol's iodine, one hour after first dose of thioamide is taken. This delay is to prevent iodine from being used as substrate for new hormone synthesis. The dosage are written below. Fourth is glucocorticoids, such as hydrocortisone. Steroids reduce T4 to T3 conversion and may have direct effect on underlying autoimmune process. Other treatment options include cholesteramine, iodinated radiocontrast agents, plasmapheresis, and lithium, that is for emergency management, whereas for subsequent management, some medication can be discontinued and others reduced. Iodine therapy is discontinued, beta blockers are withdrawn, glucocorticoids are tapered and discontinued, propylthiouracil if given, should switch to carbimazole once T3 is declining and plan for discharge. Initial dose would be 30 to 40 mg in divided dose and then titrated down to maintain euthyroidism. In Graves' disease patient, definitive therapy with radioiodine or thyroidectomy need to be arranged. That's all for this video. Thank you.